Senator Gary Peters is taking action to stop addiction before it reaches adulthood with a bill to increase access to treatment for adolescents. Take a look. Senator Gary Peters is making moves creating a new program called the Youth Act. There are right now ways in which we deal with adults uh, with medicated treatment programs that help them uh, break the addiction, but unfortunately, if you're under 18, you don't have access uh, to this type of treatment. Medical professionals believe this treatment would be very effective, particularly with adolescents that are 16, 17 years old. And we need legislation, though, to change the rules and also to create some pilot programs so that we can show that this type of treatment is very effective with, uh, with young adults. Senator Peters says opioid addiction has increased in Northeast Michigan. Yeah, I think everybody knows someone who has uh, an issue with opioid addiction. Oftentimes that addiction starts with prescription drugs. And then when those prescriptions end, uh, can be, somebody can be put in a very difficult position as they try to continue to feed that addiction. So we are seeing increases in heroin use. We're seeing increases in overdoses uh, uh, throughout northern Michigan, but all through uh, our, our state. Using the MATS program will involve a number of treatment methods. Well, there are a variety of drugs that can be used. Uh, methadone, for example, is one that is used where uh, basically drugs are put into the body to break the addiction and then you're weaned uh, from those drugs as well. Uh, carefully selected drugs that are known to be effective in breaking an addiction is a very promising area. Although Peters is focused on adolescents, he says that kids as young as 14 are getting addicted as well. They may not be getting the prescription, uh, but their parents uh, may have uh, opioids uh, in the medicine cabinet, and children will take those drugs, or, or adolescents will take those drugs, and they are, they are highly addictive. Once uh, someone starts taking these, it uh, is sometimes a very difficult path to get off. Senator Peters hopes that his bill to expand treatment passes before 2018. For WBKB News, Star Connor.